Hello, this is Tony Kranz, the General Sales Manager here at Ocean Honda San Juan Capistrano. And today we're we'll going to be doing a walk around on the 2016 Honda CRV LX. Now, this is a Honda CRV LX 2016, number one selling crossover in the US, not counting fleet sales, of course, but it is the number one selling crossover in the US. Honda sells about 350,000 units of these every year. This drivetrain engine and tra engine transmission combination is also in the Honda Accord, and combined with the Honda Accord and the CRV, the sales for the, the drivetrain in the U.S. is about 550,000. So this is a big part of what Honda does here in the States. Definitely proven drivetrain. The engine, the, the 2.4 liter engine has been in the, Honda, in the Honda CRV since 2003. And right around 2013 or 14, they integrated the Earth Dreams technology. So definitely a quality uh, drivetrain, quality vehicle. I'm just gonna go over the, some features here in the, in the rear area. As you see, you do have a good amount of space back here. You do have the grocery bag hooks here. You have your spare tire, which yes, the Hondas still have a spare tire. It is temporary use, but it, it is there. You have the equipment there to cha change the spare as well. And then with these right here, it's something they added about three or four years ago, the ability to, to drop down your um, the, the headrest here in the rear so you can have better visibility out, out of these rear windows. And it does it on each side. Also, the seats do recline if you're, if for the passengers in the rear seat. And then you do have the, the fold down lever here where you, if you pull this, you go fold down. And then on each side, do the same thing. So that's definitely a nice touch to, to, to the rear area. Very, uh, very nice feature. What I want you to do is go ahead and jump in on the passenger side. I'll go over the dash with you. So now here on the CRV, on the dash, there's some things that Honda started adding to the CRV in 2012, and that such a big hit they kept it with the re with the with the facelift for 2015. As you hear, as you see here, you do have the information display there in the middle of the dash. Now with the information display, it will show your average miles per gallon, as well as just uh, if you don't want to see anything, you just see your compass there in the time, as well as a. Um, a wallpaper setting uh, screen. So there you can actually upload an, an image through the flash drive. And there is, at, there is a USB hookup right here. So if you hook up a flash drive there, you're able to put the image there on the information display. You also have a power outlet there to charge your phone or your devices. Also have another one here. Then you have an auxiliary hookup there as well. Also another thing that's, that's shown on here, one of, my, one of the things that I actually, actually you have an audio screen there too. So when you have your stereo on, you'll be able, it'll be able to see, uh, tell you what's going on with the stereo. And here then you have your um, fuel economy screen. I'll tell you your average miles per gallon, as well as the range in the tank. And then as you drive, or drive the vehicle here, you have in the, in the middle cluster here, you're gonna have the ambient lighting on the outside of the um, speedometer. So as you drive, if you're driving efficiently, it will actually turn green to kind of coach you and guide you into how to be a more fuel efficient driver. Um, also above the driver's left knee, you do have what's known as an econ button. And with the econ button, you can turn that off and on on the fly. And what that does is it, it makes the vehicle more fuel efficient. Um, and what, essentially how it does is it limits, uh, limits power to the AC as well as controls the shifting of the transmission. So it just makes the vehicle more fuel efficient. So, and also in that middle cluster, you do have um, also the outside temperature and then just a regular speedometer, tachometer, that's all there. Here in the middle of the dash, you're gonna have uh, the controls for the air conditioning, fan speed on the left, blue is cold, red is hot, so it goes over that as well. So what I'd like to do now is I'm gonna go ahead and pull over right here and give you the, the opportunity to drive the vehicle, okay? Let me just pull over here. You wanna go, go ahead and hop over on the driver's side. I'm a little tall, so I'm gonna scoot this a little forward for you here. Wanna hop in? So underneath the, the seat, you're able to adjust the seat back if you want to slide that down. I'm gonna show you that next. Slide that down. Then also here on the on the left of the seat, there is a lever where you can make the seat go lower or make it higher to your liking. Also here underneath the, the driving column, there's a release for the telescoping wheel, and that does go up and down, in and out. And then here you have your power windows, power locks, and then there's your power mirrors. Left uh, left for the left mirror, right for the right mirror, and then you use a pad to adjust. We're gonna go ahead and take this for a ride. Hopefully you enjoyed the walk around the 2016 LX CRV.